Hello Capricorn and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning into your uh, what they wish they could say to you tarot reading. This is going to be a reading looking at your special person and what they wish they could communicate to you, talk to you about or what they wish they could have said to you as well. So it can be for Cappy, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Um, and if you enjoy this content, please feel free to leave behind a like um, and also subscribe to the channel to get updates for when readings for your sign are posted to the channel. So um, let's jump straight into the reading and see what comes up. Okay, strong Leo energy. So some of you are dealing with a Leo or maybe this is a Leo that's trying to come through in the cards. Very powerful messages. The Four of Swords, Ace of Swords, Queen of Wands. There's someone who wants to say to you, um, they either want to fight for you or that they should have fought for you harder. There's two Aces, so it makes me think there's someone here who wants another connection. They want to reinitiate re contact or they want another chance to sort of pick things up again, okay? Aces are new chapters and new beginnings. Um, and I get the sense, the card lean, leaning off here, it makes me think that there's someone here that wants to fight for you. But it also makes me think that someone may want to uh, talk to you and communicate to you. And they may want to try to start a fight. There's a lot of ego that's coming into play here. And I get that someone wants to communicate that they're very jealous over something that's going on here. I'm sensing possessiveness and jealousy. And someone wants to say, look, I'm jealous of what you've been doing. I'm jealous of the photos that you're posting. I'm jealous that your ex still talks to you. The Ace, of course, could also represent a past chapter Capricorn. And if you do have an ex still in the picture that you still communicate with, there's someone here who's, who was never happy with that or they want to tell you they weren't happy with that. Um, I do get the sense with the Two of Pentacles and the Four of Swords that there's someone here who feels it something got too much for them. And I think they want to express that, that High Priestess may be the sense of clarity that's coming up around them, um, but they're at a, a, a stage where they want to uh, express that to you. Yeah, so I get the sense that they want to express to you that... They're trying to get over you. I don't know if this is ego coming into play. There's someone who potentially wants to say, I'm trying to move on from you or I'm trying to move past it or I'm trying to lay something to rest. They're trying to quiet the mind or they're trying to um they're trying to convince themselves of some convince themselves of something here, Capricorn. Uh especially maybe like a long distance thing a geographical thing um, especially for those cappies involved in a long distance relationship or if lockdown is somehow impacting your relationship it's really getting to this person and they're at a place that they wish they could tell you how they really feel about it it's getting them to a place where they feel a little bit disconnected with the four of swords they feel like they need to really push and strain to make conversation now maybe they feel there's not much to say so i do sense there's some sort of disconnection um but i think that distancing or that dis uh, dis uh, disconnection could be happening because of some jealousy okay it's either they want to say to you okay cappy you're being way too jealous um you know you're being a bit possessive or a bit controlling so they either want to express that to you or they're feeling it on their end they're on the receiving end of it and something feels very repetitive so what the words that come to mind is like them talking to you or them saying something like look this has happened before and it's happening again or we've been through this before or i can't believe we're back here again um intuitively i feel like they have wanted to say this to you for quite some time and now it's almost like they're getting the opportunity to say it to you and it's coming from the high priestess so there is an epiphany or a transformation that i think has recently happened to them or um that they have sort of experienced they've been on the receiving end of it uh
but yeah that's that's the vibe that i'm getting from um from this person's current energies of course which could change um, the high priestess can represent pregnancy children and fertility the queen of wands is a very lustful energy so there's someone here who wants to tell you that they desire you there could also be someone that you've sort of laid to rest contact with but they're still attracted um capricorn there's someone who's still who's still very attracted to you they're still very drawn to you they still think about you you've come up as the ace of pentacles so for them I do, I do get the words missed opportunity, so I think for some of you, maybe this person can communicate, I feel like our love was a missed opportunity, or I feel us not working through things was a missed opportunity, or um, the fact that we were never, never went on to have a child, or never went on to have a physical relationship, or got to experience uh, intimacy from each other, feels like a missed opportunity, so um, there could be something around that. There, there's also someone here, though, I think that's someone that needs space, okay? They're, they're fighting with their own thoughts. They're, they're fighting with their own desires. And there's someone here that wishes they could tell you that they, they need space or they need some sort of distance from you. Because um, they're having very cyclical thoughts, okay? It's very repetitive thoughts. It um, there, There's nothing here that would indicate that that cycle is being broken, or that that cycle is ending anytime soon. I think they're still in this current energy Capricorn. They might not be forever, but I think for the time being, what we're seeing in the cards is that, yeah, they're going through some things. They're trying to fight. They're fighting some sort of battle. Now, this could be other things as well, Capricorn. There may be someone here who's fighting anxiety, who's fighting depression, who's who's in, involved in a divorce case, in a legal battle, a health battle of some kind. But um, for some reason, they haven't been able to express that with you, and that's okay. Maybe they wanted to keep it sacred. The High Priestess can represent things that are very sacred and, and sensitive, and of course, near and dear to our hearts. So maybe that's the message that this person is coming through with. Um, but also, I want to fight for you, or there's something about a fighting chance. So if it's not an internal battle, I think it's, you know, they may want to wish to say, I feel like it's such a strain to talk to you. I feel like I need, like, I feel like I'm forcing you to talk to me or trying to convince you to talk to me uh, or something of this nature here, um, Capricorn. That's the vibe that I get. But I will leave your reading at that. I, I want to thank you again for watching. Um, don't forget to like this video and also to subscribe to the channel to get notifications for when readings for your sign are posted um, to the channel as well, uh, Capricorn. Otherwise, I will leave it at that. Have a wonderful week and bye for now.